Gomco, Allied Health, blah, 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 G180. Uh, typically, you have the issue. It won't turn on. Uh, when plugged in, you'll see if the light's on, works, of course. You unplug it, turn it off, should be obvious. Dead battery. Easy enough. Pull one, two, three, four, five, six screws. Small screwdriver, pry it, get the top off. And there's your battery. Uh, pull your power entry wires right here, just off the back of power entry. Mine is broken, so that's going to go on the estimate anyway. Move them around the, the uh, motor, and now you can pop the thing in. You have much easier access. Let's pull this battery. You can pull the leads off and pass the battery out to verify it. I didn't know the battery's dead. So I change it, so it just makes sense. I like the having these nice little magnetic trays. So don't use screws, as long as they're ferrous. And that way they're not getting lost in the mess that I have going on here. If you've noticed the strange wire colors. I don't know what Allies deal is, clearly these would not be color code for anything for a battery. I mean, it's a battery, DC, black and white. I don't know why they want like brown and green, but whatever. I mean, the wire doesn't know what color it is. It's really just the person putting it back together. So pay attention so you're not thinking that this is a ground wire somewhere. There's a battery. Uh, 1250, what are we looking for? Roughly 12 to 15 volts. We got our Fluke 875. And let's see what we got here. See, black and red. Bum, 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 bum. 1.9. When 12 point, was it 7 was the minimum? Yeah, that thing's dead. But hope you don't think you're done yet. Next, you gotta check power to the battery to make sure it's even charging. So, we're gonna flick our power energy module back in so we can get AC power. In case you forgot which cable goes where, on the back of pretty much every power entry module, you will find... Where is it here? A little symbol that tells you who's line and who's neutral. See, there's your L for your line or your hot, and N for your neutral or common. Right now, that's fine. We're all over the place, aren't we? Uh, this is one of those units that runs off battery, so AC charges it. So you got to plug your battery back in. It has to have the load on there to get an accurate. So the fact that we're jumping this charging station all over the place and the sun is up with the power supply, it should be a steady charge rate. Uh, which means this thing is not worth repairing. Power entry module, rear housing, battery, power supply. I'm gonna recommend a new one. Alright, that's it guys.